Hello, this funeral programs tutorial is brought to you by the funeral program site. You may find you want to insert a single photo box or an additional text box within one of the template pages. This video will demonstrate how to do this by using our Elegance 4 page graduated funeral program that you see before you. In this example, we will be replacing the text boxes on the back cover. First, we will click on the text boxes by clicking around the perimeter of the text box and hitting delete on our keyboard. And we want to continue to do the same thing with all of the text boxes on the back page. The next thing we want to do is create a photo box and put it at the top of this back page. To do that, we're going to go View, Toolbars, Drawing. This brings up the Drawing Toolbar panel. In this panel, you're going to choose Auto Shapes and select Basic Shapes and select the rectangle. Your cursor turns into a cross. You're going to click and drag the shape and size of the rectangle that your photo will sit inside of. Position it to where you want it to be by clicking and dragging. And once you have it there, you're now ready to insert your photo. Please refer to our Insert Your Photo video on how to accomplish that. Next, we're going to insert a text box beneath this photo box. To do this, we're going to go to the Drawing Panel toolbar and click on the A with a little insert symbol next to it. When you click that, your cursor again turns into a cross. Go ahead and click and drag the approximate size and shape of the text box. And I would stay pretty even with the photo box just so that you can keep its consistency look. When you draw the text box, your cursor will begin to blink on the inside. And now you can either type your information or paste it within this box. The default when you create a text box is a white box with a black border as you see here. In order for us to make it transparent so that we can see the background over the text or behind the text, we're going to click on the text box, go up to Format, Text Box. Your text box format will appear and you will go to Fill Color, change it from white to No Fill, go to Line Color, change your line to No Line, and click OK. And now your text appears over the background image. Now you can edit the remaining areas of your program. Tune in next time for another series of video tutorials brought to you by the funeralprogramsite.com.